We finally got some new information on the Halloween 45 convention in Pasadena. We're going to talk about it. So they finally announced the event schedule for the Halloween 45 convention. So let's go ahead and take a look through everything they've announced so far. So starting off with show hours, Fridays, Horace Hollow Grounds bus tour, then Saturdays convention hours at 10 to 7, Sunday convention hours 10 to 5, um, and that's 11 to 7 and 11 to 5 for standard ticket holders. So looking at the actual event schedule, on Friday, the only thing going on, because the actual convention is Saturday and Sunday, so on Friday, we're going to have Horrors Hollow Grounds bus tour. If you're familiar with Sean Clark, he does all of the Horrors Hollow Grounds location videos. Um, those can be found on a lot of special features from all of the Halloween movies and some of the other cult classics. He also does them on his YouTube channel. So he's going to be doing a bus tour, which I think he did during the Halloween 40 convention as well. This time, um, from what he said on our previous podcast, it's going to be a little bit bigger. So it looks like probably eight or so buses full of people and they're going to do a lot of locations not just specifically to Halloween but from what he said on someone else's podcast it's going to be um, other horror locations so maybe like Prince of Darkness and so on so I'm waiting for them to announce the tickets for that because right now it does say coming soon so we'll just have to wait for those tickets to get announced and hopefully I don't miss them. Moving on to Saturday at 12 p.m., so an hour after the doors open to the standard guests, you have Halloween, the Curse of Michael Myers panel. So that's one that I'm really looking forward to. i um, really excited to see that one because Halloween 6 is one of my favorite entries in the franchise. It's one of the ones that feels the most, to me, like a, ha- a real Halloween sequel, next to Halloween 2, of course. So... Really excited for that one. The only way I think I would miss this, and it's kind of the same for most of the events here on the on the schedule. Depending on who signed autographs during the meet and greets, I may miss a panel. Um, it just really depends on the person. So a good example here for Halloween 6, if Nick Castle happens to be signing autographs somewhere else at that moment, I'd probably rather do um, the meet and greet with Nick Castle. But if it's you know someone that I mentioned on previous video that I really don't care to see, then I will probably do the Curse of Michael Myers panel. The next thing up at 1 p.m. is the Masks of Myers panel. Um, I don't know if that's going to be something where they're showcasing the masks or they're talking about creating the masks or I'd imagine it's going to be a bit of of both. Um, But to see the actual masks in person, if that's what they're going to do, if they're going to have them displayed during this panel, I'd go just for that. So then at 2 p.m., there is a live podcast. I can already say this is one that I won't care about. I mean, it's cool that they're doing it, but it's not something that I'm going to be wanting to sit in a room for when I could be, you know, hitting some of the merch booths and and picking up some new stuff or doing another autograph session. So I will likely skip over the live podcast. Then at 4 p.m., the Halloween 2 panel. This one is an absolute must for me. I love Halloween 2. So I'd imagine that's going to look a lot like the Halloween 1 panel that will come later on because it's pretty much the same cast with the exception of a few people. Um, But that's another one that's a must for me. Then at 5 p.m., this one's really cool. We have the Halloween 2018 Trilogy panel or the David Gordon Green Trilogy. Now, they did announce James Drew Courtney, but they haven't announced Andy Matichek or... Jamie Lee Curtis or Judy Greer. I'm not sure who's gonna, all going to be part of that panel. There are other people from the Halloween trilogy that will be at the convention. Like Anthony Michael Hall will be there, of course. So I'd imagine he'll be up there with James Drew Courtney. So just depending, um, that's one that I really would like to see. But it really just depends on the guest. And then at 8 p.m. is the After Hours event. Doors open at 8 o'clock. Entertainment begins at 9 o'clock. There's a $10 cover if you're not VIP. Um, I haven't done any of the After Hours events at conventions. Um, I usually always skip those. But because it's the Halloween 45 convention, traveling all the way to, to L.A. just for this. So I will more than likely show up to the After Hours event just to have the full experience and say I've done everything at the convention. Then moving on to the Sunday events, we have at 12 p.m. Halloween for the return of Michael Myers panel. That's another one that that would be huge for me. I would love to go and see that panel. It's another one of my favorite sequels in, in the franchise. My only issue here is they have not announced Danielle Harris 
if they announce Danny Harris, then that's going to be a huge panel just off of that alone. Really excited to see that one. At 1 p.m., we have Rob Zombie's Halloween 1 and 2 panel. This one could be skippable. That's another one that you'll probably get Danielle Harris if she attends. Scout Taylor Compton if they announce her as well. Um, if Rob Zombie were to show up, I doubt it, but that would be cool as well. Yeah, that would be a really cool panel to see. I just don't know if um, I'm going to take the time for the Rob Zombie one. It just really depends on what's going on outside of there. Then at 2 p.m. on Sunday is the Merchandising Myers panel. I have no idea what that is going to be. Um, it might be something I attend if it's of interest to me. But as of right now, just looking at the name of it, I don't know if it's something I really care to see. Then at 3 p.m. is Halloween 3 season of the Witch panel. I definitely would like to see this one, um, especially, you know, Tom Atkins. And he's one that I'm looking forward to meeting as well. So Halloween 3 season of the Witch panel. We'll see if we can make that one. At 4 p.m. on Sunday, this is the last panel. And there's no way I'm missing this one. Um, I don't care what's going on outside of, of the panel at that moment. And this is Halloween 1978's panel. I will absolutely be there for that one. That is a can't miss. You know, that's the OG. Pretty much everyone in the original cast, except for Jamie Lee Curtis, has been announced. So I will definitely be at the Halloween 1978 panel. Then after that is another After Hours event for Sunday, and it's one that I'm really looking forward to, and that is Drinks with Tom Atkins. And Tom Atkins, of course, you know, is from Halloween 3, Season of the Witch, played Dr. Dan Chalice. They're going to be doing Drinks with Tom Atkins at the Buccaneer Bar, which is where they filmed Halloween 3. It's the scene where he's sitting at the bar, and um, the commercial for the original Halloween comes on the TV. And So that's going to be really fun, just the opportunity to, for one, to see one of the filming locations for Halloween 3. Um, assuming it's not on the bus tour. And then also, even bigger than that, to sit down at that same bar in that same spot with Dan Chalice and, and have a drink, that's going to be great. So really looking forward to that. They have not announced tickets for Drinks with Tom Atkins yet, and they have not announced tickets for Horrors Hollow Grounds bus tour yet. So pretty much just waiting on that, and then hopefully they announce the schedules for the meet and greet events, and that way I can really start to plan out my entire weekend. They also finally announced hotel information. Um, they're going to be going with the West End Pasadena and they're going to have discounted rooms at $200 a night and it's just a few minutes away from the convention center and they'll have shuttles that go to and from the convention all weekend. Now we've already booked the hotel a few blocks away so um, I won't be staying at the West End which is perfectly fine with me because that's going to be a lot going on around that area. So there we have it. We have the event schedule. We have the hotel information finally available to us. We don't have the meet and greet schedule yet. And we don't have tickets for Hard's Hollow Grounds and drinks with Tom Atkins yet. But if you're going to the event, leave a comment below. Let me know what panels you'll be looking to see, which uh, meet and greets you'll be looking to do. And also don't forget to hit the subscribe button. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.